Shalom, Brother Kabai back with another GMS lesson. GMS keep pushing. Before I go any further, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to the Heavenly Father's only begotten Son, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakak, Badash. Double honors to our apostles and elders of Great Millstone for teaching us his truth according to the Bible and her rule well. Another Shalom to all the sincere Akims, man, throughout the four corners of the earth, pushing this truth through diligence and sincerity. All right, this is a quick lesson I want to get into, man. Um, <clears throat> throughout my travels today, I was uh, out and about, and um, I was at the light. And you know how when you like stop at a stoplight, you may look to the left of you or look to the right of you. You know, just see who's in the car next to you or whatever. And I seen this Jake. He was in the car to the left of me in the left lane. And the Jake had uh, tattoos all over his face and neck. Like of like those Egyptian hieroglyphics, okay, and um, you know Jake is 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 destroyed, man, you know. So the title of this lesson is, man, Jake is destroyed, okay. So I'm gonna grab some precepts and Lord willing, it's be an edifying lesson. All right. So without further ado, we're going to address the fact that you know Yahweh Bashim Yahweh shot is against us having tattoos, man. All right. Um, so this is Leviticus 19 and okay here it goes this is the book, uh, book of Leviticus chapter 19 verse 28 it says ye shall not make any cuttings in your flesh for the dead and that's what Jake liked to do man you know Jake will go out here cause that's what, that's what a tattoo is it's cutting into your flesh why do you think you're bleeding Okay, when you're getting tattoos, that needle, okay, is tearing into your flesh. It's cutting into your flesh, man. Okay, and 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 Jake is real heavy on getting tattoos for the dead, man. You know they want to remember, okay, their, their their homeboy or their loved ones or whatever the case may be, man. You know they don't have to do it for the dead. They'll just do it because that's the thing to do, man. Okay, but the Lord said what? Leviticus 19 and 28. Ye shall not make any cuttings in your flesh for the dead, nor print any marks upon you. Look, I, it says, I am the Lord. So the Lord said what? Just to wrap it all up, don't put no prints upon your, you know, or any marks upon you. And this Jake that I saw at the light, man, <laughs> I mean, he, he, he had, I mean, from his neck all the way up to about his, his cheek, man, with tattoos. Oh, those are e Egyptian hieroglyphics, man. You know, and I was just I was just shaking my head, man. Like, yo, Jake is really really destroyed, man. You know, and that's the thing, man. I, I people don't even, you know, they don't care. You know, here it is. The Lord has, you know, his men out here, strong with our apostles and our elders of Great Millstone. Okay, telling our people that they're, you know, they're the children of Israel. You know, they're the best thing, okay, out here. You know, the Lord loves us and only us. We're the the uh, the greatest people on 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 the planet. But what I people want to be all, you know, all all into everything else other than the God of the Bible's only begotten Son, man. Yeah, how about Shem Yahweh Shai, who the war only calls God in Jesus Christ. They will they they will uh, uh, reject that for for you know Egyptology, King Tut. Straight nonsense, man. But this is another scripture, another precept. This is uh, Isaiah 1 and 3. The ox knoweth his owner, and the ass his master's crib. Okay? But Israel doeth not know. My people doeth not consider. You know? The ox, <laughs> you know, is, 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 a, is you know, consider a, you know, a, a stupid animal. You know, a stubborn animal at like that, okay, and the ass as well. But they know who their owner is. They know who they belong to. They know where their master's crib is. They know who feeds them, okay. But the scripture says, "Israel doeth not know." And look, and it says, "My people doeth not even consider." So the Lord's people, which is you Israelites, so-called Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans, don't even consider being the children of the Lord, man. Being the Hebrew Israelites that's being spoken about in the Bible. 
that has this great history, man. You know? A lot of it bad, but a lot of it good. But still, it's our history, man. You know? Our people refuse it, man. They don't even sit there and ponder. You know? They don't sit there and, and, and think about what the uh, men of the Lord are saying and telling them, man. You know, they don't go back and do their own research. They just want to stay black, stay black and die, man. Well, look, you're going to stay black and die if you don't return back to your house by Shimmy was shot, man. Okay, um, I'm going to read down some more, yep. Verse 4, it says, Ah, sinful nation, a people laden with iniquity. That's right, sin upon sin. Because that's all Jake... That's all two thirds is good for, man. Committing sin after sin, and getting tattoos is, is, is a sin, man. It's breaking one of the laws, okay, that you have by Shmuel Shah to set up, man. Make no cuttings in your flesh, man. Okay, it says a seed of evil doers, children that are corruptors, they have forsaken the Lord. Mm-hmm. A seed of evil doers, man. Always seeking to do something terrible, man. Plotting, scheming on the next, on the, on the, on the next Israelite, man. You know how they gonna get over on the next Israelite? It says they have forsaken Isaiah one and four. They have forsaken the Lord. They have provoked the Holy One of Israel unto anger. They are going away backwards. That's right. And getting tattoos. You look, and then you gonna get it on on your neck. No, you know, near your face. Come on, man. You definitely going away backwards, man. You know, back in the day, Jake would get a tattoo, and you know, it would be it would be hidden, man. You know, somewhere on on your on your shoulder, you know, so where it could be covered up. But not, Jake just don't give a damn anymore, man. Jake just get tattoos all over the place, man, because that's the thing to do. They could look going away backwards, you know. So I'm gonna grab another precept. Um, let's go to Jeremiah. It's Jeremiah. Jeremiah 4 and 22. It says, For my people is foolish. That's right, the Israelites, man. That's the Lord's people. So called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, man. Okay? <laughs> Are foolish, man. A bunch of blockheads. A bunch of meatballs, a bunch of nincompoops, a bunch of dunts, okay? It says, they have not known me. That's right, because if you known you have about Shemiah was shot, our people would be going out here getting tattoos, okay? They wouldn't be making any cuttings in their flesh. You know, they wouldn't be marring their beards. They wouldn't be getting baldies, okay? They wouldn't be, uh, they wouldn't have dreads, okay? Long hair like a woman. They wouldn't be doing that if they known you how about Shimei was shot. It reads on Jeremiah 4 and 22. It says, they are sottish children. Mm-hmm. Stupid. Retarded. Okay. It says, and they have none understanding. That's right. Because if they did, they would not be committing these, uh, uh, um, these, 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 um, these acts, man. You know. They wouldn't be uh, uh, transgressing the law. It reads on, they are wise to do evil. Mm-hmm. And what is wise to do evil? Getting a tattoo and remembrance of a of a of a of, of someone who's who's dead and past and gone. Okay? That's wise to do evil. You think you're uh doing something good by re remembering this uh this 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 uh wicked person. Okay, because the scriptures say no one perish being innocent, you know. That's wise to do evil, man. But to do good they have no knowledge. To do good, they have no knowledge. See, people think giving a bum on the streets is being wise. But the Lord brought that man down low. You know what I'm saying? The Lord don't look at that as a good thing. You know? But to do good, they have no knowledge, man. And what's doing the good? Falling law, statute, commandments to the best of your ability. Okay? If the Lord has blessed you to get this word, receive it, you know, and teach it. You know, teach this word, man. You know, that's 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 part of doing being good, man. You know? But to do good, they have no knowledge, man. You know? They'll go out there and uh 
you know, continue to get more tattoos. You know, Jake will just rebel against this word, man. You know, you tell them, oh, you can't get tattoos. They go and get more tattoos. You know, Jake ain't going to stop because Jake is so hard headed and rebellious. You try to tell them something and look, they go and, and, and do it even more, man. You know, so I'm going to close out with one last scripture. Uh, let's see, let's see. It's Hosea 4 and 6. It says, My people, once again, which are you Hebrew Israelites, so called Negroes, Latinos, Native Americans. It says, My people are destroyed for lack of knowledge, man. Yeah, our people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. Because if Jake had any type of knowledge look, of the scriptures, not of this world, but of the scriptures, Jake wouldn't have a bunch of tattoos all over his neck and his face, man. You know? He just wouldn't. It says, because thou hast rejected knowledge. And how do you reject knowledge? Okay, by now, hearken to the words of Yahweh by Shemuel Shai, man. Okay? Jake hid his word, and, look, and instead of going right, they go left. You know? It says, I will also reject thee. That thou shall be no that thou shall be no priest to me. Yeah, so you're gonna be able to teach nobody nothing. Alright. It says, seeing that thou hast forgotten the law of thy power. Mm hmm And that people have forgotten the law of your how about me I'm shy, man. They have taken on the ways of, of, of the heathens, man. And according to Jeremiah 10, uh, uh 10, 1, 1 and 2, you know, the Lord told us not to learn the ways of these heathens, man. You know? It says, seeing that thou hast forgotten the law of thy power, I will also forget thy children. So the Lord's going to forget you, man. You know, because, you, you know, you are your forefather coming back, man. He's going to forget you, man. Because, look, you have forgotten the law. You know? So, you know, this is a little quick lesson, man. You know, Jake's destroyed. You know? You guys realize out here, if, if you're out here, you know, getting tattoos and... Stuff like that. Repent and return back to your house by Shimei Al Shah while you still have time. All right. So with that, you know, Lord, women's edifying lesson. Before I go any further, I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to the heavenly Father's only begotten Son, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakak Dash. Double honors to our apostles and elders, a great millstone for teaching us this truth according to the Bible and Haru well. Another shalom to all the sincere Akims throughout the four corners of the earth, pushing this truth through diligence and sincerity. Shalom.